and Miss Judy. Yeah, I think I'll lay around in bed for a little while longer. <laughs> yep. I got the girl on me. First thing in the morning. The chickens are starting to chirp. I didn't get their coop cleaned yesterday, so... I don't know. Maybe I'll do that today. <gasps> Goodness. Is this necessary, Judy? Okay, I get it. You want to get out. The first thing I had to do today was go into town because a couple people told me they were sending me things and I knew that there were at least two packages waiting for me there. So you know what time it is. Let's open the first one. Um, gosh, I can't. Someone told me they were sending me live flowers. So this is from Hertz Gardens and they were worried it was going to be they weren't going to be alive when they got here. So I'm going to open this up. I hope they left me a note. Otherwise, I'm going to have to go back and check through my messages and remember who it's from. So let's see what it is. Oh my goodness. First of all, I want to show you how it was packed. See that? And bubble wrap. Oh my gosh, I'm going to be super careful with this. I can see something that's alive in the top coming out. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh. All right, let me get this out. Let me get this out. Pearl Glam Beauty Berry. Oh, look at this, you guys. Pearl Glam Beauty Berry. White summer flowers produce fall berries. Can I eat them? Let's see what it says. Okay, I'm going to take this off. I'm going to take this off and read it. Pearl, I've never, I, I don't know what these are, but it is in good condition. And it says, it tells you how to raise it. Tells you how to plant it. Glam up your garden with Pearl Glam Beauty Berry Dramatic Purple Black Foliage. Carries the plant from spring to fall when white flowers give way to showy violet berries. Oh, I'm going to have to research more about these because I don't know anything about them. Oh, and it's got complete care instructions. Oh my goodness. Look, 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 look. Can you see what that's going to look like? All right, I'm going to have to find the perfect spot for this. And there, let me see if there's a note. Is there a note? There's no note. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm going to go back through my messages and find out who sent this. And then put it up like right over here. <laughs> put the name up. Thank you so much. This is the first like plant that I've received. And this is so cool. I'm going to have to find out what you can do with those berries. If they just look pretty, then they just look pretty. I need some pretty stuff. Believe me, I need some pretty stuff around my homestead. So thank you so much. Okay, let me put this down. Next one. Don't know what it is. I hope they left a note. I really do. If not, I'll go back through my, my messages and find out who sent them and put the name up. Okay, I think I've got it upside down. Oh my gosh, someone went ahead and got me one of these. You know what, I've been so desperate. I have been really wanting to give these a try again. So this is one of those Arctic Air evaporative coolers. Um, the ones that I had before weren't Arctic Air. They were um, just from Walmart and they didn't work very well. But you know what, everybody keeps suggesting these. So I am going to try this out. Um, let's see if it has a a name or a note? It does not. Okay, so I'm gonna have to find out who sent me this. And then I will put their name up there. Thank you so much. This is gonna be really cool to see if this works in the town house. Thank you, thank you. All right, it's hot today. I got stuff to do, so I better get going. Change of plans. I am going to plant this beauty berry right now. 
I went and looked it up and I was happy to find out that it apparently is easy to grow and you can plant it in containers. So guess what? I'm gonna find a container and I'm gonna plant this sucker. I also found out that they're edible and you can make them into wine and jelly. Yep, they're a mosquito repellent too. Oh, this is gonna be absolutely amazing if I can keep this thing alive. Sorry, Mr. Potatoes, but I don't think there's any potatoes in there anyhow, and I need to plant this somewhere where there is good soil, so we're gonna dump this out and then plant that beautiful beautyberry plant right in this pot. I went rifling through this a little bit just to see if I could find anything, and spoiler alert, no, I found absolutely no tubers, so I just dumped it out and just to make sure and then basically just put it all back in and got the pot ready for my new beautiful plant so yeah cue music Right now, I'm just gonna leave it back here in the shade because I just planted it. It's probably a little stressed. There's a little bit of sunlight poking through there. But then I'm gonna decide on the right place to put it, up by the tiny house somewhere where Judy can't get to it, that's for sure. So this is so cool. I can't wait to research recipes on how to cook jelly and jam and even make some wine. This is gonna be so exciting. <laughs> Look at me. I'm such a pansy. I can't stand the heat. I did manage to get all the plants watered. I had to make several trips, haul the water, hauled two loads of water down to the street. And while I was down there, I discovered something very, very amazing. I must have missed it the last time I was taking you down there and showing you stuff. So I'm going to show you that tomorrow. I'm just hoping it'll still be there and nothing will happen to it tomorrow. Uh, so yeah, I'll show you that in tomorrow's video. I'm just sitting out here right now by the chickens and their little chicken run. And they're, they're growing. They're growing so big. They're starting to get feathers. So I'll show you the chickens tomorrow. I'll try and hold each one of them up and let you see them. But these leghorns, they're kind of flighty. They don't seem to like to, you know, and I read that. I read that, that, that leghorns really aren't like your cuddly warm fuzzy chickens so I'll keep trying I mean I, I pick them up every single day and uh, hold them and bring them outside and whatnot let them run around but they're just so cute they're so sweet they've they've gotten into their their rhythm of waking up and then just before it gets dark they go into their little happy spot up there in the little enclosed that's going to be the nesting box area basically I've got to get this hardware cloth, man. I have got to encase this entire thing in hardware cloth, and i got to get some fences up. Whew. I tell you what, that stimulus check cannot come fast enough. Come on, guys. Approve the check. <laughs> anyway, that's all i got for you guys. See you in the next video.
thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.